Hi, on a previous day, Iran's President Ibrahim Raisi and Foreign Minister tragically died in a helicopter crash. This incident has sparked numerous conspiracy theories. Some experts suggest that the crash was not accidental but orchestrated by some intelligence agency other experts argue that the accident was caused by high clouds. Currently, tensions between Iran and Israel have escalated, leading to increased diplomatic strain. Some believe that the deaths of Iran's president and foreign minister Amr Abdelayan were intentional. Others attribute the crash to the use of an old helicopter. Historical incidents involving the Bell 212 can provide context for this theory. First of all, let's look at the history of the Bell 212 helicopter. These helicopters were first made for the Canadian Army at the end of the 1960s. The Bell 212 is a modification of the UH-1 Iroquois helicopter. This helicopter has two turboshaft engines, whereas the previous model had only one engine. The Bell 212 has a greater carrying capacity than the previous model. This type of helicopter was introduced in 1971. As soon as it was introduced, it became the primary helicopter in the U.S. Air Force and the Canadian Air Force and was one of the most famous helicopters in the world. Specifically, this helicopter is used for military training and transport. After a few years, it became the most famous helicopter in the world. This type of helicopter was introduced in 1971. As soon as it was introduced, it became the primary helicopter in the U.S. Air Force and the Canadian Air Force and was one of the most famous helicopters in the world. Specifically, this helicopter is used for military training and transport. The reason for the fame of the Bell 212 helicopter is its versatility. This helicopter is easy to operate in various conditions. It is commonly used for passenger transportation, military support, and rescue missions. Its versatility extends to wartime, where it can be transformed into an attack helicopter. The Bell 212 can accommodate up to 14 passengers and fly at speeds of up to 200 km per hour. With a full fuel tank, it can cover a distance of 400 km and carry payloads of up to 2,000 kg. Classified as a multi-role helicopter, it is favored by military and diplomatic leaders for reaching their destinations efficiently. The Bell 212 remained in service until 1998 when it was succeeded by the Bell 412 after undergoing upgrades. This type of helicopter is still utilized by American police, Army, Navy, and other agencies. Presently, it is also in use in Asian countries including Japan, Taiwan, and others. Among these nations, Iran also employs the Bell 212 helicopter. Iran acquired this helicopter during the reign of the Shah. At that time, Iran had a large fleet of military helicopters. We do not know how old the crashed helicopter was, it might have been around 40 years old. According to unofficial sources, this helicopter was owned by the Islamic Republic of Iran. Some experts say the helicopter had been repaired recently. There were no apparent issues before the crash. These experts claim that a foreign intelligence agency secretly tampered with the helicopter during its repair, which was the main reason for the crash. There have been so many accidents involving this helicopter worldwide. Before this accident, a near accident was reported in September 2023 near the United Arab Emirates. Similar incidents have been reported. The Bell 212 is considered one of the most dangerous helicopters in the world, according to some sources, but others say that all helicopters are inherently dangerous.